Now recording passive and residual income on episode four of Business Solutions after 2020 pandemic. Greetings, everyone, and thank you for joining me. Today, we're going to talk about what is passive income, why we need passive and residual income, and give a few examples about that topic. So how are you doing today in business? What's going on in your world of business? Have you seen any changes? Um, We're moving into the first quarter or no, we're moving, excuse me, into the second quarter of business development. And uh, I'm just really excited to hear about how everybody's journey is going. And we are excited to bring this uh, episode to you. So today we're going to talk about um, ways that we can promote ourselves in passive streams and residual streams of income. Um, I thought this was a good topic because it relates to business in many ways. And some people may not know how to go out and put themselves in a position to where money can make money for them without even, even trying to, uh, you know, um, move business tangibly, you know, you know, you're not, you're, you're, you're not specifically doing work at that moment. So what is passive income? Passive income is income you make that requires little or no daily effort to keep it up. That's important in business because many times we, you know, don't know how one business, one part of our business is going to be successful. So we have to learn to believe in ourselves. So why do we need multiple streams of income or passive income or residual income? I find, I find that if an idea fails, it's important to have plan A, plan B, plan C. And this was before the pandemic. Well, now I say you want to have all your alphabets crossed. You want to have so many ideas in the pot, stirring up continually uh, because you never know. And you always want to be on the better side of business at any given moment. So let's get some ideas of what multiple streams of income looks like online at this point. A lot of people are creating these merchandise opportunities for their clothing, teacups, coffee cups, and they're putting their logos on them. They're growing their business through um, sharing this information online and promoting themselves. Now what you've done is you've allowed people to become your advertisement portal. So when you're doing what you're doing, you can still make money um, and be seen in areas that you otherwise would not be seen. This is a phenomenal, this is a phenomenally great business idea that requires a bit of uh, creativity, but it's fun. Another great stream of income involves investing in a new business that looks solid with your investment backing someone. Not only do you become that investor, you also receive investment returns on interest. And it's very, very important when you look at residual income and see where your money is coming back, it looks very good. So what is residual income? It's defined as the remaining portion after the greater part of a quantity is gone. So loaning money to trusted startups are great investments in 2021. Also starting um, purchasing rental properties and uh, helping someone in a project or a program This right here is a great residual income because you know your money is going to come back to you. Um, Billboard rentals to advertise your company when others would otherwise be unaware of your presence. This can be done online and in real time. So you can use a billboard rental and you can advertise. You can use a side of a, a car and you can advertise when people are in high traffic areas. Renting a portion of your vehicle is, you know, is very important because it's constantly moving and it promotes your business name. It gets you out there 
And that is a way for people to passively contact you in order to continually make money. Silent business partnering is another great way that you can invest in a business as well as help an individual through business advice, consulting, and when, a, but a contract is definitely needed when this business is growing so that you know where and at what time your repayment will be administered back to you. Um, you know, some people feel that you do things for favors, but even in a verbal contract, a verbal contract can be added to a contract agreement form that says that a verbal contract said A, B, C, and D after the contract has been initiated. And independent marketing through online portals. If you have time to promote a business while you're at home anyway, why not do it? Because Google has many streams of potential businesses looking to market themselves daily and they are ready for immediate use. So independent marketing is a great way to do online portal ship. Now, some people do independent marketing through using their own high traffic website and putting a banner on of you on their site. So your small business will get featured, will get noticed. So these are just a few ideas of how to expand your stream of income in 2021. It doesn't take a great deal of effort and you can make money and in, in multitudes of ways. So leave me a comment in the comment box of how you are using passive streams of income in your business today. And hopefully it'll start a conversation uh, in business that we all need for our small business. So thank you so much for joining me and we'll see you.